Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. Today I'm gonna share with you my today's vlog of course. Um, today we went to a fish shop. This is a very big uh, fishing market. You can get all kind of fish or what you can get in Finland. Basically you will get mostly salmon fish in Finland. And we here to buy... Uh, seven of salmon fish, six for our restaurants and one for our home. We are going to grill this uh, fish in a Finnish way. We love uh, one Finnish, um, we love this salmon grill, how the Finnish people made and we are going to try this one. But before that I was thinking about to show you guys uh, and show you guys around about this uh, like super shop or market shop uh, here you can get all kind of fish uh, mostly frozen because in finland you cannot find any kind of um, ocean or seafood in usually so usually fresh so mostly there is uh, mostly frozen and it's it's uh, pretty much okay for us at least we get some and here is some normal products like canned products and uh, and different kind of products it's it's actually mostly for for the russians the russian border is super near uh, in our city called la Paranta. the it's a uh, it's maybe like a half an hour drive to uh, like finnish finland border to the russia so you know, usually russian people come to the come to the come to this site and uh, they buy uh, finished products because they are really good and yeah so here is some salted I think not salted or whatever I think sea salt um, items it's mostly rocks and uh, candle holder and some other items like lights and Ihan was enjoying some caps so here um, we had, I'm just share share with you guys there is nothing special it's just it's really pretty it was really pretty and i really wanted to buy some candles but um i wasn't i i didn't went there for these items so i'm just roaming around and see if we find something else this is the pasta section and um porridge porridge and cornflakes corn, corn section like cereal sections and you can get all of these uh, items in other shops, other Finnish shops as well. Look at this cookie jar. Like you can put cookies and candies in here. But it was 15 euro, 14.90. So it's almost 15 euro. It was kind of expensive. I was then actually pretty much sure to buy these items. Um, and there's some other small baskets and hooks. Um, they're really really pretty if you if you live in Finland I would suggest you to go there and check out and I I wouldn't say that they're cheap they're kind of normal price in other shops like other shops and but you can find a lot of varieties and item uh, varieties of items and they're beautiful pretty pretty items and this is some kitchen sections there are some pots and pans also some cupboards knives some kitchen items mostly uh, for the fish you can use to cut the fish so um, and this is the tea section last um, last week we went to our friend's home and they serve us with some beautiful uh, some so romantic tea to us but it was this anti-stress tea it was super good, so I order six of them. Six of them of anti-stress and two of them detox tea. They are really, really good. You can try that. So we already end up like shopping and now we are already at home. I'm going to make a uh, mashed potato. So I'm just peeling off the potatoes. Uh, in this video, I'm not going to show you how I make the mashed potato, but I have a video and um, I, I have a video of a re like recipe. I already put it in the uh, video, but I'm going to put that link in the description box below. And also 
um, also uh, end of this video you can see if you want to check that out please go and check that out I'm gonna put it in this video like end of this video so I'm just peeling off all my potatoes um, I was thinking to make a lot of them because my son really likes the mashed potatoes and I think I really like I, my, my mashed potatoes actually really really mashed and really good so here are the potatoes that I'm gonna use so what kind of potatoes you like guys uh, do you like smashed potatoes or roasted potatoes or french fries or do you like sweet potatoes more than uh, this potatoes so let me know in the comment you guys um, I it will be I will be really appreciated that if you guys tell me what you guys like and I hope that you see these videos um, to the end and if you guys wanted to see any other things you can just tell me so I just put my potatoes to the to be boiled and I'm gonna take out all the shoppings that I bought from the disaster shop uh, the shop called disaster um, that fish shop the fish market so I take some lemons and some smetana and also this uh, dish I don't know like what is a dish fragrance or something and also this uh, you can see that the wire this is for the eggs and some scents they like some home scents I chose um, rose and lavender and this is olive oil and also some candies they have they had like so many varieties of candies that reminds me of Bangladesh we usually have these kind of chocolates all the time all the year in our home so this is the some maybe peach and orange flavor and this is the fish we just take one of them So now for my husband, he will wash the fish and put it in the oven and today he will make the fish, not me. Look at the fish, it looks so good, like so good inside, like orange. I really like this fish, um, instead of this fish, people usually eat this uh, in a sushi raw but for me i'm not like a raw person i cannot eat any animals raw so but it's really good so i'm gonna make that uh, on the top of um foil paper and i'm just putting some olive oil on the on the sheet and spread that well um with hand <laughs> Actually, we had like um, this utensil, but it was easy to spread with hand. And we're going to make this only one side of the fish, not the other, because it's so big and we are just three person. So now for the sauce, we took um, one lemon and one 350 grams of smetana and some pepper and salt and that's it and if you want you can put some lemon zest on the top of the fish and that's all guys that's all you can add um, this uh, like citruna pipuri uh, that means um, I don't know what it's called like citrus paper I think it's like lemon paper uh, that's that's much more better than normal paper and I'm going to mix this really well
on the top of the fish we put some salt uh, not salt but some pepper and some lemon zest and i'm gonna spread all the batter i mean yeah all the sauce on the top of this uh, fish it's always important to grill your fish um, upside like this like the skin have to be down and the and the meat have to be on the top the reason is the heat um, if the heat comes like then the skin will be burn uh, burn not the fish meat you know what i mean i hope you guys understand my english is getting super bad so now it's time to put the fish in the oven and we're going to set the time it looks super good right so now we're going to set the time for like 50 minutes it was 250 degrees celsius and in a fan mode and it was up for 50 minutes it's better to be like 45 but we just we just want to see what happened so we put it like 50 minutes and now i'm gonna make this sauce um i find this hollandaise sauce this is a fish sauce um it, and it was ready made people usually make like from starch but i cannot i don't know the recipe and i didn't have that energy that's why i buy this um, ready made sauce and i'm going to just just stir it in the oven for some some few minutes and then pour it pour it into the into a bowl it's a side sauce you can eat with fish or maybe mashed potato as well so it was uh, about 42 42 minutes and it's done it's good that we didn't wait for 50 minutes because you can see the sides are burned not the fish side but the sauce like side sauce but it's fine at least the fish is intake so the fish looks super great and it was really really tasty trust me if you guys want to try you can try at home it's really simple just nothing you don't need nothing and here Yan is helping me to put the dish on the table he's a good boy he's a really really good boy So here is all of the thing, the mashed potato, the sauce, the lemon and the fish. That's it. This will be our dinner today. It was healthy, simple. It doesn't take a lot of time. And yeah, we really enjoyed this dish.